Right now at 5.30, a doctor accused of sexually assaulting more than 70 patients is now being sued. Dr. William Thompson, the fourth, specialized in treating members of the LGBTQ plus community. NBC4's Karma Dickerson joins us live now from Hogue Hospital in Newport Beach with those details. Karma. Yes, the hospital also being sued in this case because the doctor had clinical privileges here. Now, there are dozens of people who are named in this lawsuit, and attorneys say that number could rise to the point where it's approaching 100 victims who have come forward. Now, we should warn you, some of the things you're going to hear are going to be graphic. At a time in our history when we're asked to place unprecedented trust in medical professionals, person after person told us today that trust has been broken after their experience with Orange County physician Dr. William Moore Thompson IV. Until this point, I haven't found another doctor that can go to to find help for, for myself. I've been just not wanting to see any other doctors. We did everything that our doctor told us to do and we ended up being molested. These men are some of the 73 who are suing the Orange County doctor, accusing him of sexually abusing them during doctor appointments. I didn't think twice about it, that it was a part of the procedure. The exams, in my opinion, were over the top. Aggressive prostate exams and absolutely too many. And when I would look back, he never wore gloves either. According to the lawsuit, Thompson specialized in LGBTQ care. The lawsuit also includes Hug Memorial Hospital, where Thompson, according to the hospital, had clinical privileges, in addition to working at his Newport Beach office, claiming the hospital ignored red flags about the behavior he's accused of. This is a huge scandal for, for Orange County, and, and the gravity and the scale of it's going to be gigantic. These allegations are not new to Dr. Thompson, whose medical license is currently suspended, according to the California Medical Board. He was arrested last September and now faces 20 felony counts related to assaulting male patients under the pretext of medical care. Well, we need to send a message today, not just to Dr. Thompson, but to everyone out there still in our community like him, that you can do what you do, but you will not get away with it forever. To Hogue Hospital for a response to everything that's they sent us a statement that says, in part, Dr. Thompson operated an independent medical practice and was not employed by Hogue or its affiliates. He had clinical privileges at Hogue Hospital, which were summarily suspended by the medical staff following the filing of criminal charges against him. We also reached out to Dr. Thompson's attorney, but have not yet heard back. Reporting live from Newport Beach, I'm Karma Dickerson, NBC4 News.